when the Chernobyl nuclear power station exploded 25 years ago. Authorities chose to encase the damaged reactor in a massive stone coffin to halt the release of further radiation. It was only intended as a temporary measure. And now the concrete and steel structure, known as a sarcophagus, is so badly damaged that officials plan to build a new high-tech seal. Today, the sarcophagus and everything around it presents a serious danger to public health. In 2007, two French companies, Vinci and Bouig, were granted the contract to build a new protective shelter. The shelter will have two functions. The first one will be the protection of the plant during dismantling in order to avoid the, the dust, radioactive dust, to escape in the uh, air. And the second function will be uh, to carry a huge crane below the, the arc in order to dismantle the plant. The project, however, has been hit by delays. Work began last year and is expected to be completed in 2015, three years behind the schedule. The shelter will take the form of a giant arch, measuring 108 metres high, 162 metres long and 257 metres wide. There are two layers of metal and composite materials separated by a cushion of air. The new shelter will be built alongside the ruined reactor and will weigh some 23,000 tonnes once complete. However, the problem of waste disposal is yet to be solved. French firm Arriva had started on a project to build safe storage facilities, but it pulled out in 2007.